All right, guys, Shade Dub is back, and today we're going to review The Thing. And no, this is not a remake, okay? This is a prequel to John Carpenter's 1982 version. The film takes place in 1982. It takes place a day before John, John Carpenter's movie starts. <clears throat> and the film stars Mary Elizabeth Winstead and Joe Car... Carchin? Hold on. Joe Edgington. Ugh. Anyway. <laughs> um. Now, I wonder if you, you're probably saying, does it tie in? Is it good? It's decent. <clears throat> okay. I don't say that about any prequels unless it was the Star Wars prequels. It's a decent story. Um. I actually had fun with this. You know, it was actually a good movie. It was a little bit of bad acting from the dude that played and Dumb and Dumber Er. I don't know his name because I don't care about bad actors and bad prequels or sequels to good movies. <laughs> so, yeah. Alright, the story begins in 1982. Okay. Um, a couple of friends start talking and then they ask Mary Elizabeth Wednesday if, they want, if she wants to join them on this expedition. Okay to um, Antarctica for some stuff. So she agrees and they fly there. After, um, well, after, basically, what happened is they found this spaceship and a being, like an alien creature, frozen. That's what they need Mary Elizabeth Winstead and them to do so she can help them study the creature. So when they get there, you know, how one person to one or two people are the smart ones and the rest of them are all stupid yeah that's just what happens in here um they celebrate you know they, they got stuff like that um he one person wants to have this wants to take a sample of the creature which she that she says i don't think that's a good idea but what do you think happens he takes the sample anyway <laughs> and while they're celebrating unbeknownst to them the ice is slowly melting, all right? And the creature breaks out as only way CGI can break a creature out of ice. <laughs> but it was okay cuz it it was it was okay. Um it was a nice blend of CGI and practical effects. That's why I I, I praise this movie highly for cuz it used both aspects. Um So yeah. It breaks out and starts tr like taking control, like trying to kill people and like taking over their identities, you know. And I like movies like that where you don't know who's the killer and what's what and stuff like that. It makes everybody seem isolated and they all gotta look at each other like with these weird faces on their faces like, don't look at me like that. <laughs> you know, I like stuff like that. I like when you have to think about who could be the alien and who's not but I like the way it turned out cuz I didn't know it could spread like that cuz I only seen the original 1982 version for like the first 15 20 minutes I didn't even see the whole movie I saw the first 15 20 minutes so I'm about to get that a rewatch cuz if I probably watched that all the way through I probably would have known this but I didn't I'm not gonna give that away so don't worry about it that was just my fault for not doing my homework. And I'm a movie buff, crying out loud. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, uh, the, effect were, the effects were good. Um, the story was good. Most of the acting was decent. I can, I can handle some of that stuff. The CGI was fair. They, they did mix it with practical effects, too. The practical effects I would prefer the most. I prefer anything practical over CGI any day. Only for movies where it's not like a bigger like a bigger budget like this movie. This is probably like a twenty or thirty million dollar movie, maybe. Uh matter of fact, let's see. Yep. A thirty eight million dollar movie. So I'm thinking just they just use it where it's at. Just use it where it's needed. The only CGI that would probably be good that was needed is when he when the creature broke out of the ice and when they set it on fire. You know. But uh 
yeah, I'm gonna have to give this movie a four out of five just because I sim I basically enjoyed it and this it ties in very well. So yeah, that was my review of the thing. I am J Dub. I'm out. Peace.